Alrighty-o, welcome back to the Sonic Mania Let's Play. And today I'm going to be taking on the next two zones. And this is going to be starting off with Hydrocity Zone from Sonic 3. Now, as a lot of you may be wondering, yes, I actually prefer this over Labyrinth Zone. At least this one is more, a lot less, you know, a lot less uh, painful to go through. And it's more, you know, a much better zone to go through considering the considering the amount of it's the second half of the stage well the second act is ra is rather incredible and of course the best way to see tails drown yay yes that's right if tails doesn't get a bubble he'll drown because he can't get bubbles like sonic does in sonic and tails mode you can actually see him drown that's another way of... Wait a minute, did Tails glitch? <laughs> Sorry, Tails. Looks like you have been... You've just got glitched. Ah, oh, I should have ducked. Ah. Right, going up. Right, let's get the water up. Yep, ladies and gentlemen, look at the gimmick. It's from Sonic 2 Master System and Master System Game Gear Sonic 2. 8-bit Sonic 2, or should we call it? So I'm still deciding, deciding to hold off my decision to become Super Sonic until when the time is right. Alright. God damn it. There we go. We got... So these hooks either, you know, lower or raise the water level in this zone, in this act of the zone. So which really makes the uh, level design quite creative, though. Come on, don't hit me any... Don't hit me, please don't hit me. All right, bubble time. Ooh, extra life, and we got an extra life as well. Better not hit those enemies with the spikes. Ah! No! The bubble popped, and I lost my rings. God damn you, stupid bubble! Ah, you. Yes, that's right. That stupid bubble just snitched on me. It looks like I have to get more rings to get super, to become super. That's that was my damn fault. I shouldn't have jumped. Looks like I might not go super until Act Two, I believe, because we're near the uh, boss anyway, the Act One boss. I do absolutely like how this uh, music, like Act 1 of Stardust Speedway, actually kind of is a bit of New Jack Swing. Kind of one of the... Kind of influential to see good old T Lopes to actually do some... Influ have a few, you know, 90s influences in music today. So what on earth is Robotnik up to? What is Robotnik up to this time? Let's have a look. Oh my god, what is that doctor up to? Is he doing what I think he's doing? Oh, that son of a... That toe-faced egg belly slime ball. Okay, Tails, I'm gonna have to let you drown, unfortunately. Goodbye, Fox Boy! So long! Ha <laughs> ha! Sorry, I just... I don't want to be as... I don't want to be a hateful to Tails, but the thing is, I just think that Tails abuse is always fun when you're playing the 60-bit the, uh, Sonic games. Uh-oh. Oh, yes! I'm piloting the Eggmobile! <gasps> oh. Oh, that was... Uh, he could... That stupid bomb got on first. 
But, but in this zone, you get to take revenge on Dr. Egg by using the boss from the original Hydrosity Zone. You can use it to destroy, pull Dr. Eggman up. That's the only way to defeat him. He goes down in four hits, which is basically possibly the best, one of the best mini bosses of the game because of this. And goodbye, Robotnik. Don't let... Uh, it's been so fun bashing you all the time. Alright, so with that revenge boss done, we can finally get on with... We are now moving on to Act 2, which is basically largely the same. Which basically has some similar differences, similarities to Act 2 of Sonic 3's original zone. Considering that you can unleash your speed like in the original! That's right! You can absolutely go flat out in this zone! Like this! Especially, in, even if you're underwater, you'll absolutely go flat out in this zone. It's absolutely amazing. The, how they, I absolutely am quite happy how they made this faithful to the original zone in Sonic 3. And of course, you can either go into the water and destroy bridges by getting rid of those, you know, those turret bots. And of course, those piranha bots could also go to hell as well. Do I hate those piranha bots because they they can own, they'll get rid of your, one of your they can destroy your rings though. You'll see what happens later on, there because there's some. There was a. Uh, oh, the drowning music came up, but I managed to get out just in time. Got a nice, lovely ring. Boing! Up we go, Sonic. I absolutely love how, like how the background is vibrant and has a lot of it going. Yes, here we go. This is it. Time to finally just time to finally go through the zone in absolute breakneck speed. Time to absolutely rip this joint. And I absolutely like how they managed to remaster the presentation and make it as faithful as in the original version of Hy the original Hydrocity. Whee! Look at this! I can even outrun the screen as well in this game! It's all oh, so awesome! I love think this makes this game so bloody damn awesome! I mean, this is why I like Sonic Mania! You would absolutely... And of course, because Super Sonic can't, can't hold his breath like in the original game, because there's no hyper, son uh, hyper you know, transformation, you can actually use the bubble shield in order to, to actually get infinite air, which is a great thing, because if you actually get a bubble shield, you can absolutely survive underwater, which is a good thing, by the way. A cop. Yeah, look at that. Super Sonic going in right... Out running the screen again. Well done to Sonic. He's going up and there we go. So now let's get on with the boss. Okay, so come on, Robotnik. You know you've lost last time. You will lose again. So basically, in the normal mode, you can actually use these mines to get rid of. Uh, you could use these mines to destroy Dr. Robotic, but with Super Sonic, you can actually abuse this boss. What? 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 What just happened? Did I just suddenly glitch out? What? <laughs> I glitched! <laughs> oh, I'll be back in a minute. Eventually. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe it. I cannot believe I glitched. 
Oh, oh, no, so, oh, oh. I just can't believe it happened unexpectedly. <laughs> oh, hopefully that didn't happen again. Thank God. <laughs> oh God, that was so hilarious, though. I will admit that was unexpected, but honestly, that was so. No, I could not. Get, I'm gonna be any angry with that. That was so bloody comical. <laughs> oh, I gotta calm down. Okay. Okay, so now with that uh, first phase, because I used supersonic, the only way you can actually get rid of it is using mines by using the switch on it. Now, doc in this second phase, Dr. Robotnik uses, of course, the boss, the mini boss from the original Hydrosity Zone. But instead of six hits, I believe it's eight hits. In the same area that the Act 1 boss was in the original in Sonic 3 and Knuckles. And we did it. Because of Super Sonic, I managed to cheese that boss. So we're going to move on to our next zone, Mirage Saloon. And Whoa! What? That son of a bitch just knocked Knuckles off. Oh my god. So basically, that guy was actually the... The, the heavy magician. Another one of the hard boiled heavies. But he's going to. We're going to see to that guy much later on. So, Act 1 of Mirage Saloon basically t does a sky bait. It's basically sky. Uh, what? Weak Fortress. Dude, it does a sky. Basically, does the what are the zones for? Oh, what was it again? Let me have a look. Uh, uh, cannot believe. But baby, you'll get the point. It's. But we all know this is from Sonic 2. This gimmick kit, the first zone is. Apart from another one segment of the level, and it also has a mini boss as well, which we fight in the skies, which is pretty cool. We can't believe we're in the tornado once again. All well, these armadillos. No, no, sky chase. Yes, sky chase zone. Yes, I kind of had a bit of a, you know, one of my moments of forgetfulness. Ugh. Come on. What is that? That looks like sounds like a train. Basically, this one has the sky chase zone erectic in it. And Oh, I should have. I shouldn't have done that. So done the uh, drop dash on this one. Yeah. So basically, this is a, the first act is m mostly sky, ch sky chase zone with a bit of a twist. This zone around tails is hero in a helmet, wearing hit wearing that pilot helmet, which basically sounds a bit like the West. This one basically is kind of like it's one of the one of those one of the unused zones from Psych 2, which. Resembles Dust Hill Zone, one of the lost zones from the original, from the beta of Sonic 2. And it also uses the some of the Sky Chase enemies that were redone, especially the flying armadillos replacing the turtles. And we have those uh, missile drop here things. Missile dropper drones that resemble cactus. But those only are in Act 1. I actually do like the music of this zone, which is pretty good. Basically, the music is really Wild West themed. Oh, right here, we got the shield again. So, unfortunately, what happened was that Knuckles got knocked off and which actually, there is an exclusive zone to Knuckles, but we'll get to that when I do Knuckles' uh, scenario. What is that? What have we got to now? <gasps> Could that be the Robotnik Express is back? And is it, is it truly canon to the series? What are those containers? Oh my god. Don't tell me we got 
what I think we've got. Ooh, we got a giant ring. Oh, oh, Zed. Oh, no. Don't tell me we've got Oil Ocean coming up. One of my most hated zones in the classic Sonic games. Oh. Oh, we got light. Ooh, lightning shield. Good. I could be able to uh, go over that set of spikes and, of course, use that thing. Get some nice, lovely rings. We're ready for our next boss. Wee! Thank you, Tails! Oh no. What are you doing now? Uh oh. What's going on? Right, let's go! Better not go too fast. I'm trying to hit you, you stupid worm. Right, so it goes down in six hits. So, of course, when the head comes up, jump up towards it. I think using the lightning shield would be more recommendable. Yes! Finally done it! Got it. Oh! I don't think there's any uh, bonus items down below, considering that we're going to be... Considering the heavy, the heavy's going to hold it anyway. Got through Act 1. Well done, Sonic. No cool bonus, because we died. <sighs> the magician gets away, but... Who's that? Coming up. Knack the Weasel? What did he just do? He just downed the tornado using a pop, using a cork. Wow, I didn't, I didn't know those things were lethal. Anyway, that takes us to Mirage Saloon Act Two, which was shown off as another one of the levels that was shown off in the when when the game was in development. And guess what? There's Knack the Weasel, but oh, that stupid armadillo! Just die already! That thing just came up to me. Ugh. All right. So next up, we got some nice, lovely Wild West. We got some no a nice, lovely Wild West thing. Oh, what is? Oh, I can push that. Oh, <gasps> oh, yes! And that earned me up. That apparently earned me one of the trophies in this game, which basically is called the seek the seek the password. The secret password is special stage, which basically unveils a secret area in one of the in this stage. But that's the that's the one that I just showed you that alternate route where you can find a a special stage ring. Or the giant ring, as I call it. Yes! Come on, Sonic! Let's go! And then find that magician and... Who decided to unleash... Knack the weasel. Bark the polar bear. Be the dynamite! There are those wanted signs, but... Are they... Are they really here? Well, Knack is here. So I presume so. Okay, so we go down... And boss time! Oh yeah! Alright, here we go! There we go, we got to do is to do that. Here we go, so we've got Snack the Weasel. Now it's been the dynamite! Now thanks to Super Sonic, I can absolutely cheese this boss! No. Get out of my way, Bark! And he goes back to that the Weasel game before being defeated. So here we go! There we go! That magician is gone! So basically, his that was his final trick. His final trick was done. 
No more magic for him. <laughs> Seems like his tarot, his luck just ran out. All right, so where are we going next? It looks like that looks like oil ocean zone. Which we're going to next. Ugh, I didn't even want to be sappy to see this return. So uh, next time I'm going to be taking on the next new zone, start off with Oil Ocean, and I'll see you guys in part 5 of the Sonic Mania Let's Play.